Hello, people. It is Tuesday, and so therefore we're in the wardrobe. Well, actually not in the wardrobe, but what I'm noticing now is that I'm packing away a lot of people's winter garments and winter shoes and so forth. And of course, boots play a part of that. And most of the time you've got your boots in the closet all year round, but you kind of have them in the background, not the foreground. Unless, you, of course, you're a cowboy or a cowgirl and you just yeehaw, like to ride them and walk in those boots all the time. So nevertheless, look at this. Okay, so most of your boots are probably in the closet like this, just flopping over, flop, 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 like this. And you wanna kind of like maintain the structure of a boot so that when the next season comes, it's not a mess and it's not crinkled and you haven't lost the shape or the structure of the boot. Um, a good thing and a good place to start is with a boot shaper. And um, this boot straight shaper, if you, if you can, and if you would like to, you can find some of these actually at your um, cobbler or your shoe man or your shoe repair shop. Um, they have these in there and you'll notice that they have little finger rings for you to pull the boots up with. So like say for instance, we put this in this floppy boot, put it in like this and you can see how it is so structured and it stays up straight. And this is actually very good for storage. Um, and then of course you just pull it out. If you don't want to spend that kind of money for it, I made some, some makeshift ones with some foam. And these are actually pretty good. I mean, these are foam um, cutouts. I just bought a block of foam from Michael's or from any kind of um, craft store. Um, and you can actually make foam cutouts, you know, square. I tried to make mine look like a boot, uh, okay, with a nub. I mean, okay, whatever, you, you get the picture. So anyway, it goes in, look at that, fabulous. Fat. It doesn't even come out, look at that. <laughs> Perfect, look at that, perfect. So this is good and if you really are on a budget and you just kind of figure I've got a lot you've got a lot of stuff that has been sent to you um, via um, our friends over at Amazon or something like this then what you can do is take this this is or any other kind of paper that you've actually got roll it up and look this works just as well stick it in and you see that it works just as good and it also does not end up in a landfill because you're using it. Just like some of the other um, videos I've actually done with you stuffing your purses with all this stuff. Um, you can find a lot of uses for all of this stuff, all of this packaging that comes in all of your um, goodies that you get from certain places. <laughs> I was told that I can't say places that aren't being environmentally friendly, although they're trying. I know that I wrote enough letters and they were actually sending me my stuff without all the packaging and with the biodegradable packaging. So it was actually good. And then for people that with short boots, you might think that short boots don't wiggle and waggle a lot because they're too short. Well, they do. And they can actually lose their shape and their structure too. Of course, you're not gonna try to, uh, to put this big tall foam in it, but you will actually, um, you can cut the foam because you're buying it at a craft shop. So you can buy them however big or small you want and cut a little piece and put in here. Or once again, look at all this stuff. This comes in handy. So you just simply stuff your short boot with it too. And this works just as good. I mean, and it keeps the structure and um, it looks pretty good. The boot stands up tall and you just press it out to make sure that um, all the little wrinkles are out of it. Ta -da! you have a cute boot and ready for next winter. You could actually wear these in the spring and in the summer. I'm gonna rock these boots in the summer, but um, because they're just fabulous. Uh, but anyway, when you're actually storing away your boots, when they have a foam, um, foam cushion in it or one of these other boot um, shapers, you can then lay them actually down on top of each other, you know, head to toe, head to toe, head to toe, head to toe, and stack them neatly in the back of your wardrobe and you don't necessarily have to take up shoe space. And in the front, you've got all your spring, summer shoes, your beach shoes and all that kind of good stuff so that you're out of the door really fast and you're enjoying yourself in this fantastic weather. Oh my gosh, the sun is out and I'm about to get out of here. 
Um, I'm about to enjoy it and enjoy myself and have an ice cream and maybe a cheeseburger. I don't know. Anyway, until next time, hopefully this has been um, something that's helped you on this beautiful wardrobe Tuesday. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Mwah! Love you. Bye-bye.